Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Why is Crazy Woods fucker inside a house? Well, this is what we as felons call extenuated circumstances. So me and one of my buddies decided to go out to the bar last night. Long story short, I ended up sleeping underneath some pine trees. But unluckily for me, that was across the street from the hospital. Hospital security spotted me, they brought the cops, the cops woke me up, and they had an ES, EMS unit on site ready. So I blew like a .29, so they decided that I would just go to the hospital and the cops didn't want to get involved. So they gave me one of those, you know, they put me in a room, they gave me one of those nightgowns and a bag to put my clothes on, so I give them my clothes. So I shut the door, changed into the nightgown, put my clothes under the mattress, and then put a bunch of sheets and shit inside the bag and handed it back to them. I waited a couple minutes, put my clothes back on, and tried to leave. They uh, they spotted me, and uh, this this is you know a crucial juncture. If you're ever ever in this situation. You don't run out. That means you have to go by like the security checkpoint and shit. You run deeper into the hospital and try to find some employee entrance or exit or even a fire escape. So, yeah, I made it out of that one. That was fun. So I spent all night like running around Ipsy trying to ditch the cops and shit. Finally, I'd spend like my last few bucks on a taxi cab just to get back from Ipsy. Oh, yeah. And uh, I get home, check my messages, and uh, I lost my job, too. <laughs> I, uh, uh, this, is, this is just awesome. Uh, now I have way more time to make videos for you guys, so that's good. And uh, so, yeah, no credits, no bullshit, no jokes, no music. Just this is Crazy Woods fucker saying, uh, who gives a shit?